What's up, SBM gang? I'm back with another YouTube tutorial, and it's no shade. Shout out to Ali Pearl for sending me this bust down curly wig. Y'all know Ali Pearl only sends me bust downs. This HD frontal wig was so full, so luscious, so thick. I didn't have to put no makeup on the lace. I feel like this wig came with like six bundles. It was so thick and full. But anyways, y'all know Ali Pearl already comes with the quality. This is like my third Ali Pearl collab in every wig was it i was never disappointed i never have any complaints and it's really no shade but y'all need to order this wig and let me know what y'all think because if it's giving what it was giving for me you're gonna be slayed and it's no shade y'all always asking me for a plucking tutorial so here it is I, it's only a little bit but it's just enough for y'all to get the point like i don't know what y'all be wanting for me i part the hair and then i pluck like I don't know, you just gotta pluck it, like, <laughs> don't pluck too much though, because if it's bald, when you put it on your client head, that's so embarrassing, but yes, I probably will be having virtual classes and one-on-one -on -one classes soon enough, but for now, this gotta be enough for y'all, like, part that hair and thin it out, and once you thin it out, move on, and you also don't want to do too much, because you gotta wait till it's on, you know, their head, and then you can customize it to their face no shade but that's the best way I can explain it as y'all can see I didn't put no lace tint no makeup on this wig and it's just lay it's really no shade this wig really melted in I'm using my boho lace tape to get this wig tight and right y'all know the lace tape once that's on the wig not coming off for at least two and a half weeks so I just had to do that because we was doing some dancing this is my new model Shaquita guys yeah Shaquita is beating her face like get into her snatching this nose like she doesn't play she's certified like shout out to Shaquita girl boho lemon burst on the melt as always y'all know lemon burst is my favorite because it smells good and it's just my go-to i love active as well but my lemon burst is my fave right now that's the one i've been ODing and using with all my installs it's either taping lemon burst or just lemon burst by itself and it's really no shade just apply that until it dries clear and then put that lace on key is to make sure you put your lace on not too far up and not too far back and make sure you blow dry that glue and make sure it dries before you tie it down because you don't want your glue to stick to any of your elastic bands your paper strips none of that so blow dry her real quick all cool to warm I used to be strict about just only using cold air but these days I'll put a little warmth to it because I need my stuff to be dry I don't have time no shade but cool air does majority make sure your glue dries and it's no shade I'm using my eyebrow razor it's dull I need to get a new one I'm tired of it child and with HD lace you really could use scissors and it wouldn't even matter but but because I'm just used to it I'm using my eyebrow razor and I'm getting it cut off Shout out to my phone. We doing a fun updo, so I needed to make sure this hair was molded and ready to go. For the inspo, we was looking on Pinterest and we found this cute fun hairstyle. And I was like, oh, let's go to the hair store and get some bows to match our cute little orange outfits for the TikTok we did. And we just made it happen. This hairstyle was so cute. I don't know who the original stylist was. So if you guys know, put it in the comments. Let me know so I get them their credit because they slayed that. And I sure did copy and it's no shade. <laughs> Can we talk about the melt on this lace real quick? Like, there's no makeup, no lace tint. I just slapped this thing on Shaquita's skin, and it's giving. Like, stop playing with Ali Pearl. Stop playing with their HD lace. It's giving, and I barely had to do any plucking. So, their pre-plucked really means pre-plucked. 
Now, I did do a little, little one-two pluck, but I didn't overdo it. Like, y'all know some of them wigs be too damn thick, and I be plucking for two hours. It wasn't the case with this. So, shout out to Ali Pro. They really do be coming through with the quality. Baby hairs, I decided to do mousse because I wasn't going for the hard look today, so I didn't do hairspray. I wanted it to be real soft, real natural. So, I said, let me do my mousse so I can manipulate it and make sure it's exactly how I want it. Now for this updo child, it was a process. And I don't even know how to really explain it without getting aggravated how I did in the morning. So basically you got two pigtails. Okay, boom. Each pigtail is going to be sectioned off into three rows. So you do three rubber bands two times. So the first row, you do three rubber bands. And then you go back and do another row of rubber bands. One, two, three. And then you put all the hair into a pigtail. Girl, my fat ass fingers, as you can see, my fingers are fat. They was popping rubber bands. I was getting aggravated. Some of them was crooked. I was like, oh gosh, this is so tedious. And I did two rows of three. So that was three, six, nine, twelve. Twelve rubber bands in total. So I was aggravated by the end of this process, but it came out so cute. So I was like, ugh. The things we do to be cute, child. So now that that's finally over, I'm just going in, making sure my two front pieces is laid and flayed. And then I'm going in to add these knockers, these bowls. I don't know what y'all call them. Y'all let me know in the comments. Do y'all call these things knockers or hair bowls? I think I'm going to just go with hair bowls because it's the safer option. I know that's not wrong. Knockers, I don't know if that's wrong or not. I think I hear people call it knockers, but I'm really not sure. <laughs> but yeah, we got them at the hair store. There was a dollar a pack. We got white, brown, and white clear and orange because that matched the outfit we was wearing for TikTok and it came out so cute
And it pretty much all came together. This is the final look. Like, no shade. Shout out to Ali Pearl for sending me the bust down as always. I will have all the info for this wig in the description box below. Thank y'all so much for getting me to 5K subscribers. We're deep into 5Ks now. I just don't know the exact number. But pretty soon we're going to be at 10K. Then we're going to be at 100K. Then I'm going to be getting my plaque. So shout out to the SBM gang. We're small, but we're growing. And we're here to stay. It is no shade. So shout out to y'all. Keep liking, commenting, sharing, subscribing. Show my girl Shaquita Boo some love. She's new in the hood. And her information will be in the description box as well. And it's really no shade. Bye, y'all.